I challenged myself to eat a gummy bear. And I th threw up. Hello, people of the internet. It's me, London Addict, here. And uh, today I bring you a, uh, another cancerous clip video of me talking about bullshit for about 5 minutes and 23 seconds. So, today we're going to be talking about challenges. YouTube challenges. Like 24 hour challenges, eat this challenge, suck a man off challenge. There are so many different challenges on YouTube. They're literally, they do not stop. There's just new ones being created every single day and it just doesn't stop. There's like, eat the gummy bear challenge. Like the fucking intro of this video. Anyway, yeah, so the most recent challenge in my ears that I've heard of is the 24 hour challenges and where you just. Yeah, I mean, it's pretty much illegal because, you know, you could do it in illegal areas like fucking 24 hour Walmart or some shit like that, but. That's besides the point. Basically, it's just fucking stupid. Because people will get themselves arrested just to do a 24 hour challenge. Basically what they'll do is, it's a Walmart 24 hour challenge. Basically what they will do is they will find a small shelf that they could fit into and stay there for approximately 24 hours. Or they, what they assume is 24 fucking hours. Which I think is complete bullshit, and they should just do normal fucking challenges, like... Fucking... Vomit... Warning challenges. Like, dudes... There's not... There's a lot of those, alright? There's too many. And... That's good, but... 24 hours, man... It's just completely fucking retarded, to be honest. I mean... I don't know who the fuck started the trends. I, I mean, I think I know. But I don't think I know. I mean, I mean, I'm pretty sure fucking official Dark Studios cleared this up one time about 24 hour challenges so you could uh, go on YouTube and search uh, official Duck Studios, uh, they like to call themselves official cancer studios I think, or official dick in your ass studios, I'm not insulting them, they literally call themselves this sometimes, yeah, it's just a group of three people, anyway, yeah, so, challenges, they, they, there's just so many, there's just, they never stop, really. I mean, in the background of this game, there's Fallout. You could do the Fallout challenge for fucking 24 hours. Anything could pr pretty much be, like, 24 hours, but, like, the 24 hour, as in, fucking stay somewhere and sleep there challenge is quite retarded. But, it could be nice sometimes if you're doing a 24 hour challenge while sleeping as, you know, camping. That is 1000% fine, in my opinion. Basically, it's just, I feel like I'd like to uh, spread my uh, opinion across the uh, cancerous views of YouTube and shit, saying that 24-hour challenges are pretty much just a waste of time. I mean, it's nice entertainment, like I'm doing to you, but my, I'm probably not very entertaining. I'm probably, I probably made you sleep by now. But anyway, yeah, so... I think other people think the 24 hour challenges are very amusing, I don't really find them amusing. But, you know, that's me, I don't really find a lot of things funny. I, I don't find anything funny to be honest, it's, it's, it's quite stupid, you know. I mean, I'm recording this video, and I'm watching, or see, seeing a fucking 24 hour video in the background. Normally, uh, I got my Xbox, I got my phone, and uh laptop out while I record my voice in the background of the fucking video that you see in the background because my laptop's there because I need a fucking OneDrive and all that and save the video and shit like that but that's besides the point of this fucking video I think 24 hour challenges is a little bit over the fucking board and obviously you're not gonna be seeing anything like that from fucking me anytime soon because I don't waste my fucking time for 24 hours normally if I'm doing anything for 24 fucking hours, I'm either fucking masturbating, or I'm just fucking playing video games for the rest of my life, alright? There's nothing else like FUCKING DO- So, it's- it's just- it just doesn't get across their fucking thick heads that they should just stop recording 24 hour videos. Literally, I remember one guy recorded a 24 hour video and he got himself fucking arrested. I mean- Probably like every other fucking YouTuber that tried doing a 24 hour challenge. 
Some guy died while doing a 24 hour challenge and I'm not really sure and I'm not going to put that in the description or anything. How he died or where he died or how, where he died. I already said that but whatever right. This video is going to end and you should just think twice about searching for a 24 hour challenge. And just think to yourself, it's retarded. Goodbye.